from beautiful Florida. And today our question comes to us from Damascus. And Damascus has a question, which is a hypothetical question, which she asked in my Monday night chat room, which I've been doing for some 16 years now. And she asked it because I made the comment that I could use some vlog questions. But it's a good question, and although we've dealt with it in previous vlogs, it certainly bears revisiting. And the question is this, why am I never attracted to male deity figures, but only to goddesses? And must there always be duality in the deities that we work with? And my answer to this is that when we talk about duality, when we talk about the polar powers, we're talking about the cosmic powers of the universe, the structure of the universe and why things work the way they work. It isn't necessarily a matter of our personal spirituality, though it can be. It's more a matter of the mechanics of things. And when we talk about our personal spirituality, about our patron deities and so forth, we're talking about our personal spiritual growth. And our personal spirituality must serve our needs and not everyone else's. Or it does us no good to have personal spirituality. So must we always have duality in our personal spirituality? Well, only if we want it there. If you're more comfortable working with goddesses, then you should work with goddesses. And if it comes to pass that a male god figure should call you out and want to work with you, well, then at that time you certainly should. But until that happens, you should do what is comfortable for you and what is working for you spiritually. And as far as duality and the polar powers go, that again has to do with the nature of the universe and the nature of reality. It's very important to understand it, and it's very good to acknowledge it in ritual. But it isn't the same thing that you're looking for in your personal spirituality. That might be different depending on your personal needs. It's certainly good to be aware of it, it's good to acknowledge and to honor it, but in terms of personal spirituality, you want to follow where you're led, because your inner self will lead you to what you need. So those would be my thoughts on the matter. I hope you find them interesting, and until next time, may you blessed be. Hello, this is Reverend Don Lewis, coming to you from witchschool.com. Are you looking for the best in pagan and magical education? With more than 12,000 pages, witchcool.com is like having your own personal library with individual learning assistants to help you study. And Witchcool's Anyone, Anytime, Anywhere education system is available any place on Earth, anywhere you are and anytime you want it, as long as you have an internet connection. Witchcool's lifetime memberships are a great value. They really do last a lifetime. They've been there for years, and they'll be there for years to come. So get your membership today at witchcool.com.